Hi everybody, I just wanted to do a quick video for users who are new to Notepad++ and wanted to get to know how to start using the find and replace function. I'll put a link in the description below this video to Notepad++. You can go to the download page, download the latest version and uh, you've then got at your fingertips a free, very good text editor that's great for when you're modding DAISY files. Um, so find and replace, you tend to use this um, quite a lot because you'll want to replace um, a lot of code that's the same with something else that is the same and instead of having to go through and manually change things you can just replace a whole block of them for example let's say we were working on the CFG spawnable types the XML and we wanted to change the damage values of things now I'm not going to cover wildcards in this we're just going to go with specifics but let's say we wanted to change everything that said um, damage min equals 0.2, max to 0.5 to another value. So what you could do is you could highlight the bit that you wanted to change, copy that, click somewhere else, type Control F to bring up the fine, the fine dialog, and then click on replace. And then what you can do, get rid of the, anything that's in there already, and then just paste in what you've copied and let's uh, paste in with replace what we want to replace it with so let's replace it with say damage equals zero max equals zero so this stuff isn't going to going to get um, have any damage when it spawns in Oop. so what we could do is you can find and replace a, a number of different things so what we could do is we could if we wanted to make a selection like that click back in the uh, replace box and we could then tick that in selection so it would only replace any that it found in this selection with what it can see there be careful of replace all in all open documents if like me you've got a lot of documents open <laughs> because if you don't notice and you do that you could change stuff you didn't mean to but probably the most common one you're going to use is you're going to replace all so you click on replace all and as you can see they all just change to zero 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 now, when you use find and replace in this way without any wildcards, just remember that it is only going to change the um, values that, that it finds that are exactly the same of what you're looking for. So here we've got another one. So car radiator, min zero, max 0 0.35. So let's say we wanted to change that. Um, so we would paste that in replace. And let's say we wanted to change it to um, max equals 0.2. And then 0.5 and replace all. Now you can always see at the bottom, it always tells you what it's done. Replaced all occurrence were, were replaced in the entire file. And you can scroll down and you can use it that, that way. So there's going to be many instances when you're doing some coding with Daisy or any other program um, in Notepad++. And you're going to get to that situation where you're like, oh gosh, I don't want to have to manually go in and change all these values. And this is where you use find and replace. But just be careful that you are accurate with what you're pasting in and you understand the limits of what you want to change. So that's where often using a selection can be very, very helpful because it stops you changing things that you didn't want to. So there we go. Find and replace in Notepad++, the very basics. Click in the link in the description below the video to download Notepad++. And after this, what you probably want to do is do a search for wildcards and then you start getting into advanced find and replace then. Anyway, that's enough from me. Hopefully you've found this useful. If you have it, like, if you want to see more of the same, press subscribe, and I'll see you again soon.